Hi guys. So let's look at this next question here. Uh, this question says that the difference between the roots of the equation x square minus 2kx plus 3k equal to 0 is 4, where both the roots are positive fx is an equation whose roots are three more than the roots of the given equation find the value of f10 okay so now uh, the the original quality equation let's say it is ax square plus bx plus c equal to zero on which all the formulas and formulas are based in, in terms of a and b right so here if i compare it to this equation that is x square minus 2kx plus 3k equal to zero okay so Let's assume that the roots of the equation are a and b. Uh, sorry, a and b will match here. So let's it, let's uh, take it to be some um, p and q. I can take okay. So let's take the roots as p and q here. Okay. So if p and q are the roots of this equation, so what I can write here is I can write sum of roots. Uh, I know sum of roots is equal to that is uh, minus b by a. So here this is minus of minus two k. That will be plus two uh, k divide by a that is a is 1 sum of roots is 2k that therefore p plus q will be equal to 2k correct now product of roots is c by a that is equal to c is 3k here and it is 1 so that basically means that it is 3k divided by 1 uh, that is therefore p into q, q is equal to 3k and it's given that difference between the roots is 4 so basically uh, i can't say that uh, dif because difference between a and b means a minus b and b minus a both right so it difference means i don't know which which is which is the part here so that means i'll take a modulus here so that means modulus of p minus q is equal to 4 that means modulus means it could be p minus q also q minus p also okay and the both roots are positive so again we have an we have three things given here p plus q p q and p minus q so i can simply use the uh, identity that is p minus q whole is square is equal to p plus q whole is square minus 4 p q that's a very common identity so now this p minus q whole is square is equal to p plus q whole is square minus 4 p q so i'll just put the values here so because it's a modulus now so if you modulus if you square so modulus will go off right basically mod of x ka whole is square is equal to x square so modulus aapka nikal jayega right so we're left with now 4 square is equal to 16 p plus q is actually uh, 2k whole square minus 4 into pq what is pq pq is 3k here right that means 16 is equal to 4k is square minus 12k so i got a quadratic equation in terms of k here i can divide by 4 also so i'll be getting k is square minus 3k minus 4 is equal to 0 right so now k is square minus 4k plus k minus 4 equal to 0 so k into k minus 4 plus 1 into k minus 4 equal to 0 that basically means that k plus 1 into k minus 4 is equal to 0 so i can write here therefore i can write that um, k is equal to uh, minus 1 or 4 so obviously so see k cannot be minus 1 here because if k is minus 1 here so in that case uh, sum of roots will be negative both the roots are positive sum of roots can't be negative right so k is equal to 4 is the only possibility so once i write k is equal to 4 here now sum of roots will be p plus q will be equal to 2 into 4 uh, 8 and product of roots will be equal to p into q that is equal to 12 so now um, i can solve for p and q here actually because i need to find another equation whose roots are three more than the roots of given equation so we have also p minus q equal to 4 right so if i try to solve this p plus q is equal to 8 and p minus q is equal to 4 if i add these two equations i'll be getting uh, 2p uh, that is 2 uh, this is 2p is 12 therefore i'll be getting p is equal to 6 and i'll be getting q equal to 2 so 2p is 12 so p is 6 and p minus q is 4 so q equal to 2 i'll be getting now after this uh, so we have now we have one more equation fx here whose roots are three more than the original equation right so that means in f for fx we'll have its roots let's say its two roots are p1 and q1 so it will be three more than the previous uh, uh, root right that is 6 plus 3 will be equal to 9 and 2 plus 3 will be equal to 5 so my uh, roots are now 9 and 5 
Now sum of roots is equal to 14 and product of roots is 45. 9 8 plus 5 14 and 9 into 5 45. So I know that my original equation is what? So whenever I write like uh, whenever we have sum of roots and product of root is given, product of roots. So my original equation is x square minus sx plus p is equal to 0. Yeah, no? Sum of roots and product of roots s and p. So I can just put this here. So that means my fx will be equal to x square minus sx that is 14x plus p that is 45 okay now they have what they have asked here they have asked the value of f10 okay so they have asked the value of f10 here so i just try to find f10 now so f of 10 means you can simply put x equal to 10 here that becomes 10 is square minus 14 into 10 plus uh, 45 that is 100 minus 140 minus 40 plus 45 is 5 so f10 is 5 so 5 is the answer for this question Okay, so these are very common things in last question also we use this identity you know, that is p minus q p plus q voila. here also this so using this are we should be very should be, be very comfortable using these identities in a question okay these identities are uh, of very high importance in algebra in different questions right so I hope all of you got this thank you. Let me ask a doubt feature and this is absolutely free for everyone so you can just download the unacademy app it is available in the website and app and uh, in this you can crop any uh, you can uh, click any picture you can crop the question part and you can submit and within four to six hours you get that solutions okay and that is mostly in the video form so you can this is absolutely free for everyone so please use this feature guys uh, you can ask up to three doubts in a go till it is clear and again you can post three doubts okay you can also uh, get solution in english or hindi depending on your preferred language so this is this feature is available in your website and your app it is absolutely free of cost for everyone so just go uh, to an academy you can post any doubt and you get a video solution by our top faculties okay thank you